Hello everybody, welcome to Ingo Terra Odyssey. I'm hoping the wind won't blow away my cards. I'm in a little alcove in my backyard, but the wind is so beautiful and cool outside right now. So I wanted to do your read outside and provide you with some fresh sunlight. And here comes one of the cats too. Hello, pretty princess. So today's read is going to be about do you already know your soulmate? Some people are invested in a new tribe of people and they're wondering a lot of you you know is this person that's in this group come back to me because they're my soulmate oftentimes it takes a little while to make that connection oftentimes things form a friendship um, or a large grouping it's like our energies are magnetic to one another so we're kind of reintroduced in many different formats so we're going to find out if you already are in you know the presence of your soulmate or if they are coming and what the um conditions and all the um energy surrounding that are about so we have three cards to choose from um we have the electric eel spirit bring your ideas to life we have number two which is panther spirit reclaim your power we have number three which is eagle spirit spirit has your back which spirit does <laughs> And thank you guys yesterday for on Instagram and everywhere with all your cool comments on the new ring. As soon as I put it in the store, it sold. It's very hard to get hold of stones with that amazing, amazing clarity cut. Um, it was just an all around. The, what was the most gorgeous aquamarine I've ever gotten my hands on? So I was like, I can't keep this to myself. So <laughs> as soon as it went in the store, it sold like within 10 minutes. So. I'll start perusing around and see if I can get other um, stones of that magnitude because it just the way it sparkled and twinkled it was the one I wore in yesterday's video was just amazing it was super mesmerizing and uh, I'm always impressed when I find beautiful quality stones so let's see what's going on with number one okay bring your ideas to life firstly I feel like this is for the creative crowd too I feel like when we're really doing what our life path purpose is and what engages us and we absolutely love and adore our frequency and our vibration goes way up and something happens on a cellular level a magnetic and energetic level that starts to attract the things that we deserve and we've been looking for in our life and oftentimes that is the perfect love our soulmate um, great abundance things of that nature because we simply oscillating on a higher beautiful attraction level as well so let's see what's going on so we have Danu and I am going to see what's going on to a fire Mm, that's really nice. Give these a shuffle. The hanged man. Oops, let me pull this over here. It's like when I'm outside, I have to use certain ballasts as well as um, things to block the wind because things will try to go away. This is a beautiful color combination. Wow. So. For, for the majority of you, I'm seeing you have yet to meet them, yet they are coming very soon, probably around the two-month time period as well. They are now also looking out into the future and wishing for you. As you know, that famous saying, what we are seeking is also seeking us. So they are seeking you and they're trying to align with their energy. Oftentimes, it's just a little kind of adjustment on our perspective of life because so many people think they need to be uber prepared for this love, that it's going to be hard, that they have to be something that they are not. And it's not, it's actually the opposite. They just need to be who they truly are and um, just follow their truth and follow their bliss and be joyful and have your um have your spirits raised looking forward to this love i feel like your life is going to start to take on a beautiful cohesion so be assured you'll be assured you'll have that feeling they're on their way you feel good it's almost like an energetic hug that energy you feel them around you um, you start to feel more um, prosperous in life, calm. I feel like you have these lovely warm-ups to the day, like when you wake up. You can't wait for certain things. You have lovely optimism, and that's very important. And this was due to the fact that there was a delay and a blockage in your soulmate. What happens often with our spectacular others is they go through a metamorphosis. They go through a stage where um, they're at a point of discovery in their life. They're usually at a place that is undeniably too small for them. They're growing. They want to stretch their wings. They want to find out who they really are. And um, 
that that can be a painful process because we often have to leave people behind we often have to leave jobs behind all of a sudden some people wake up and they're just like why the hell do I work for this company that doesn't appreciate me a hundred percent dozens of you have said that that all of a sudden you know that what you required in the past is a whole different set of requirements now for your happiness and that's what's going on with them and they're waking up from this 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 is awakened slumber so now they're moving toward you so have assurance feel good know that it's happening you're creating this your momentum your belief in this and you know everything all of this kind of beautiful bold energy that has magic in it that's moving towards us we have to give it its momentum and its stride without trying to chase it down or feel a lack because it isn't here yet right we're not a wonderful human being because we have a mate in life or a um, person by our side we're a wonderful beautiful spiritual being because we were created this way and it's just wonderful to have a companion with us and that's why they're coming and I love how the colors kind of matched up and there's a beautiful cohesion to this picture right here too yeah a lot of flexibility is going to come up in your life where you're not so um stern or thinking that things have to be a certain way you're going to be you know um, magnetically drawn to the correct people places and things that are going to give you peace of mind and relaxation which is really beautiful so i love that for you group one gorgeous if you're new to the channel don't forget to press like and subscribe and all my links are down below if you need a private read whatever i'm going to put this back over there the eagle spirit yeah um everything's down there my etsy store thank you guys for helping support my channel by buying the goddess provisions box which is off the hook with the singing bowl check that out as well on the tuning fork the lotions and potions and goodies everything is just so striking and wonderful and that it's i mean i love supporting local artisans too i mean that's one of the biggest reasons i said yes to um, that brand is because, you know, everything is just beautiful, organic, and right up my alley. All the things that I love, you know, sights, sounds, and everything that has to do with holistic healing, really beautiful. So, you guys, amazing. Go for it. I'm excited. So, Panther Spirit, reclaim your power. Let's see what's going on for you guys. It's funny. I'm trying to dodge where I am in my garden. I have very thick foliage, and I have... Um, these killer mosquitoes that pop out every once in a while oh my gosh so you have the sun and you have the king of swords this is funny i'm already feeling you guys with the with these numbers and these visions i'm going to pull a clarifying card too right now time yep this is this is actually split you guys 50 50 about 50 percent of you already are with your soulmates the people that you are with and that you have currently just met or you have been with for some time you already have that feeling you already know you're with your soulmate and they provide that magic and loving connection that you were yearning for and you knew right away it's one of those things where we almost don't want the responsibility that's so heady when we finally meet a lot of fear can be involved for people because they're like is there only one and there really isn't there's a series and because we um we have so many different kinds of soulmates and soul tribes and soul members but what distinguishes it is once you meet them you can't even imagine your life without them and right before they arrived too you your soul and your mind and your body and everything became in this perfect preparation to receive this energy so you could be on your highest vibration and connect beautifully and have patience and all of that and have a sense of calm because a lot of people panic when we get what we want sometimes we're like what in the actual hell right you ever do that like you're wishing and wishing all this like christmas then you haven't you're like what do i do with this you know it's one of those things where we have to get into that and what what makes this really clear for me is the sun on one side and the king of swords you're you're you've already been thinking this 50 percent of you this person is my soulmate i can tell you have clarity you have that king energy which is like an absolute you're not guessing kings don't guess they're they're situated in a place where they have absolute knowing and strength to that and part of that was this beautiful divine sun energy the raw energy just shining down on you and you being hopeful happy and you know just having this great optimism but most importantly the gratitude you had for your life the love um your regular family the things that you had that brought about your soulmate and the other 50 percent that are calling them in we're going to pull in some clarifiers for all of you yes yeah, see the balance is coming in the three to three which makes the six your your other sort of soul half which is beautiful and empress energy that's you yes yeah, every single day elevating in every single way the way you speak the way you behave um understanding that other people are at different venues in their soul you know they might not have reached the point where they um are free of gossip or harboring 
any any kind of you know um, lower level vibration jealousy things like that of that nature um, perhaps gluttony stuff like that like they just don't they, they don't have the understanding yet so you're every single day you're you're like how can I improve what can I do and I feel like you're getting more and more creative a lot of you will be feeling that both you that are with your soulmate and those that have their soulmate approaching something happens with us really on the cellular level where we are trying to complete processes so we can go on to the next higher perspective and level of learning and understanding about the world and knowing you know that we're here simply for that for that purpose to experience love and the planet and others and help one another and that some people get a little lost along the way and they forget that stuff is not important they can forget that um, being mean or unkind devalues everybody in the scenario mostly the person that's perpetrating that behavior things like that but this is about you really whoo, cutting down the middle fair even I love the number six and the six of earth is, you know, that beautiful grounded energy where, you know, you've planted the seeds, you knew what you want, you know what you want in a person, you know where you are at in life and you're, you have this beautiful momentum and you're pulling this love towards you in a, in a gorgeous, gracious way. You know, you, you're developing a, a more humble persona where even if you're accomplishing things, just because you're wearing a watch doesn't mean you have to tell everybody what time it is. It's really wonderful and people are attracted to that. So you're becoming very, very magnetic. And this is, you know, this is right down the pike. Let me pull a time card for this too. Okay. Yeah, for some of you, this is going to be five months and under that this match is coming in for you. So that's really wonderful. I love this card too. I love this unicorn that's just jumping over a fountain and decides to rest in the middle of it. Like, I'm going to leave this. Oh no, I'm going to take a nap in this fountain. <laughs> and he looks like he kicked it in with his hoof. I love these. These are the El Marie tarot cards. And they have that type of back. They're really beautiful. Yeah, so you have plenty of time. I love it. So let's see, August, September, October, November, December, Christmas. So this is some Christmas love. So say yes to office parties and everything going around. I just feel a lovely sense of happiness rising in your soul, knowing that, you know, everything is going to feel more optimal. Like you're getting results quicker. You're, you're feeling that the steps you're taking actually have payoff you know it's because sometimes it's like we can do something I feel like people do this in diets if they don't get quick enough results or like why am I doing this and people think it's so painstaking but when we really stretch it out time is so cylindrical I'm and cyclical sorry cylindrical so cyclical that it always comes back and we always get a chance to try again so let's not beat ourselves up beautiful energy look at this I feel like that's also going to be one of your totem animals the stack and I feel like you're going to see a lot of things that have to do with Ra and the sun god, unicorns, things like that. And I love time because it's saying, you know, you have all the time in the world. You really do. Be restful, be happy, be joyful, and enjoy the things that you like and don't race to the next thing. I have to remind myself of this. When I'm looking at art, it like it's almost like if I get three decks in the mail, you know, I just order them and they all show up at once. I'll find myself racing through one to go see the others instead of savoring every bit of art. That's when I slow down and I'm like, you know what, why don't you just open one today so you can purely savor that. Time, that's a reminder. Time is saying, please do that. You know, savor what's going on and what's happening around you because um, each moment is its own special accomplishment and we never know what we're going to derive from that right so we really got to keep our eyes on it now onto eagle spirit where spirit has your back I love that I feel like you're going to start to feel this you're going to start to feel um protected divinely directed like you're going to be looking for something you're going to get those answers you're going to be feeling something you're going to know why immediately you're going to um if you feel like you missed out on something something better immediately is going to follow that so you wanted to go for a certain job and you didn't get hired on that a much better deal follows that immediately it's just those lovely divine moments so let me give these a shuffle and see what's coming call yeah, so this is, I always feel like this is the message card. Oh my gosh, you're called to love. I love that. Okay, so from what I'm seeing with this next one, yeah, it is on its way. Pages is a slower, a sm that is slower and um, slower in message together, slower. So we're just going to have that. It's a slower moving energy and message. It's not like a knight that's hell bent for leather coming to give you that. So you feel like you have been patient, you've been waiting, but it's like this beautiful pixie fairy is going to show up and whisper in your ear. They're almost here. It's going to let you know and reiterate that fact that they are arriving. You have done the work mentally. You've been picturing them. You've probably been having dreams about them. I'm certain you've seen very 
very synchronistic numbers with 11 11s i feel like when you look at the clock it's 333 it's 555 um, a, a series of numbers watch your receipts over the next few days you'll get lots of 555s five, 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 so i feel like that's going to be one of your numbers yeah love is arriving and that when when love is arriving something really magical happens we start to feel love we see love everywhere we look at couples and we're charmed by them especially elderly couples i think they're so sweet you know animals that are you know cats that walk side by side things like that you're going to see love all around that's part of the majesty that comes in with us preparing for our love to ele to elevate ourselves, our loving soul energy our frequency all of that and the call I feel like you'll be hearing that you'll be watching I feel a lot of this is gonna have to do with music too that you're gonna be hearing more and more love songs and really really identifying with them the feelings the sentiment all of that and here's going to be your main overall energy that's calling to you. this beautiful, miraculous queen of earth energy that says, you know, you're lovely and grounded and earthy and you understand you garner strength from nature and from trees and flowers. And you're basically, you are the one who creates and molds your future. And you do that by your thought process. You do that about preparing for the day with a really positive headspace and saying today you know I'm not going to push myself but I'm going to do whatever I can to create beauty and magic in my world and peace and harmony for those around me little treats like you'll be at the store and you're like hey I should get somebody their favorite cupcakes or I should get somebody you know their favorite um almonds things like that being thoughtful of other people because that kind of it only it germinates seeds in other people's gardens that they should do the same and it's very contagious so you're kind of like the pipe piper of goodwill and it's really elevating and it's really lovely I like that. And one of your, your main energies is adaptability with Ayane. Now, adaptability is just saying be flexible. If you have big plans and they fall through, so what? I'm going to a water park instead. If somebody has, you thought you were going to be able to score a certain venue to do something or concert tickets have fall through, so what? I'm going to something else. I'll go to a different concert. I'll go see... Um, <laughs> you're going to die, but I almost said Bob Hope, like that came to mind. I'm sorry. Welcome to 1965. <laughs> I meant to say, um, what the hell? It has nothing to do with any of that. Um, <laughs> who cares? Whatever. I'm having name blanks. But anyway, it's like, whatever, you're just going to carry on and you know, you're not going to be harping back on what you didn't get but you're looking forward to what you will receive that is the love energy because all these little things don't really matter where you get to go what you get to acquire and all of that it seems very little in this big picture of love that is coming towards you faster and faster and you you know having this sense of abundance and love and it's it's a rare phase and I love this I feel like this whole August energy is absolutely astounding especially um August 15th when this Aquarius full moon comes in because that's about celebrating who you are your friends where you are in life where you're going everything rich and flavorful and enduring and long-term planning and it makes you feel good and it makes you feel like you have strong foundation and I love that energy for you group three so beautiful energy if you're new to my channel don't forget to press like and subscribe and all my links are down below if you need a private read um, if you want to go to my Etsy store and check out all my gems, I may list this emerald. It's like, I just, I felt so good because someone was so happy with that aquamarine that this is my favorite ring I've ever had, this rough um, emerald. It's hard for me to find stones that I really just connect with and I, I almost can't like believe my good luck in them. And this is definitely one of the one on my middle finger. And then the one on my ring finger is a... Um, a uh, green tourmaline. I'm really attracted to tourmalines too. Um, uh, green stones and aquamarines are so beautiful. Earth and water colors, right? Like these, like this is looks so miraculous with that stone. I love that. So thank you guys again for tuning in and watching my videos and you subscribers and my patrons and you guys showing your support and love. I can't tell you how much I appreciate your comments and look forward to reading them and connecting with you guys. You, you really are such a brilliant lot and you make my life like so wonderful it really is you know every day i wake up and i'm excited to connect with you and find new ideas to get us all inspired for the direction we're moving in it's really lovely so i'm going to go upload and we'll talk soon